Today we will see the one numerical of a graph theory. The numerical is obtain the network equilibrium equation of a given circuit. <coughs> so first I would like to say that the network equilibrium equation we have to find B Z B B transpose into I L equal to B into V S. This is the network equilibrium equations formula B Z B B transpose into I L is equal to B into V S and B is the tie set matrix Z B is the impedance. B transpose IL is the load current. Okay, Vs is the voltage source. So first step of the network equilibrium equation is to we have to find the uh, we have to draw the graph. Okay, so all the resistance and the voltage source we have to draw a single line, and afterward we have to draw a tree. Okay, so here I have drawn. Here you can see I have drawn a graph and a tree. Okay, and I have given a number 1, 2, 3, uh, 4, 5, and 6. And here, same, but uh, we have drawn a tree, and other than tree, we have drawn a dotted line. And we have drawn a loop. Okay, we have drawn a loop. And the loop direction is as of the tweed. Okay. Here you can see the first loop is 1, 4, 6. Second loop is 2, 4, 5. And third is 3, 5, and 6. And the direction of this loop will be as of a tweed. Means 1 is a, our tweed. 1 is our tie set. So direction will be of this type. Okay. So for first wave direction of this is like of 1, this direction of related to 2 and the direction of this loop is related to 3. Now we know that in the tie set matrix, <coughs> if the loop matches with the tweak, we will write 1 and if it opposes, so we write minus 1. So what will be the answer? So the answer will be like this here we have to write the branches 1 2 3 4 5 6 and here we have to write tie set the first tie set is the 1 4 6 second is 2 4 5 and third is 3 5 6 now how we have written this let's see uh, I will solve for the first uh, you can see here the direction of this and one which is matches with one so we have right one four it is also matches with the four we have here one and six the direction of six and the direction of the loop is opposite so we have here right written minus one and which are not in loop we write here zero okay same for second loop direction of two is matches with the loop so we have written here one 5 it matches we have right here 1 and the direction of 4 and the loop is opposite so we have right on here minus 1 and otherwise it will be 0 okay same for this loop okay so what will the tie set matrix b is equal to 1 0 0 1 0 minus 1 0 1 0 minus 1 1 0 and 0 0 1 0 minus 1 1 same here we have written this is transfer into b okay so till here we have understood so what we have to find first we have to draw a graph again tree and find out the tie set matrix which is known as a b okay now second step is we have to find 
B Z B into B transpose. Oh, sorry, B into Z B. Okay. We have find B. Now we have to find B into Z B. B into Z B. Now how we will to find B into Z B? We have find first B. Now Z B is nothing but the branches current. Okay. We have seen earlier. We have seen earlier one branch connect five ohm. Two we have five. Three we have five. Uh, four we have ten. For five fifth branch we have ten ohm, and for six branch we have ten ohm. So we we'll write here we have six branches. So six by six we have to write. So our answer will be B into B. B into Z B will be like this. Okay. See here. For first branch we have five. Otherwise zero. Second branch we have five. Third branch we have five. Fourth branch we have ten. Fifth branch have ten and sixth branch have ten. Means this is one. This is two. This is three. This is four, five, and six. And six. Okay. So first branch contains five ohm, second branch contains five ohm, third branch contains five ohm as same here four, five, and six. Okay. Now what will be the second step? We have to multiply this with this term. B into Z B will be. How we will find one into five? Five. Okay. Zero into zero. Zero. Okay, means first row, first column, first row, second column, third row, third column. This way, we have to find. Okay, so one into five, five zero into zero zero into zero, one into zero zero. We have to get five. Okay. Now for first row, second column one into zero, zero into zero, zero into zero, zero into zero. Yeah, will become zero. Now first row. Third column one into zero 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 into zero 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 into zero. This will be also zero. First row fourth column one into zero zero into zero plus zero into zero one into ten ten zero into zero minus one. Means we have to add. Okay. Means how we will find one into five five plus zero into zero zero into zero one into zero zero into zero. And minus one into zero. This will be equal to five. This is first row and first column. Same for first row, second, first row, third, second row, first column, second row, second column, second row, third column. All we have to find, and our answer will be like this. Okay, B Z B is equal to five zero zero ten zero minus ten zero five zero minus ten ten zero 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 five zero minus ten into ten. Now, now third step will be B into Z B into B transpose. Our third step will be B into Z B into B transpose. B transpose means the row will convert converted into column, column is converted into row, and the answer will be like this. Okay, B into Z B into B transpose. Equal to five into B transpose. Okay, means we have five here B Z B and B transpose. We have written here. Okay, now again we have to calculate this both. Okay, so by calculating this, what will be the answer? Five into five plus zero into zero plus zero into zero ten into one means fifteen. How we have to find C here? Simple step. I will first sign. First, I will find first row, first column. Okay. So five into one, five plus zero into zero, zero plus zero into zero, zero plus ten into one plus ten plus zero into zero 
minus 10 into minus 1 will be plus 10 equal to 10 plus 10 plus 5 is 25 same for first row second column first row third column second row first column second row second column second row third column third row first column third row second column third row third column okay so our answer will be this one okay bzb into b transpose will be 25 we have i have given the example how to find 25 minus 10 minus 10 minus 10 25 minus 10 minus 10 minus 10 25 and the last one will be b into zb into b transpose into ir ir and nothing but the we have written here loop current 1 2 and 3 so this will be i1 i2 and i3 so this is the lhs side of this method okay now what will the right side right hand side so right hand side is the we have to find b into vs first we have find b now voltage source you can see in the diagram the voltage source here is of 1 volt which is in first branch second third fourth fifth six we have no voltage source so we are right here zero 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 okay so six branches in first branch we have one volt other branches zero so we have written here zero and our answer will be like this okay b into vs equal to one zero 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 okay this is our answer how this will be equal to one zero zero one into one zero into zero zero first row first column second row second column third row and third column answer will be one zero zero and our final answer will be 20 this is uh, we write here in matrix form equal to one zero zero now if you in exam if it asks that find out the i1 i2 and i3 so how, how we will find i1 i1 is equal to del 1 by del i2 is equal to using mat, uh, i2 is equal to del 2 by del by using Kramer's rules okay this is the way to find out the i1 i2 and i3 okay so this is the network equilibrium equation with easy explanation